From thousands of entries, we are down to your top 12 at the Nine Jasper Italian Hunt Season 3. I am VJ Adams, super excited to be here. The semifinals means a whole lot for the contestants. They will perform tonight like their lives depend on it. The viewers will watch as you're here right now, but more importantly, the judges will give their remarks. Now, for perspective, beyond your votes, the judges' remarks will play an integral part of deciding who will emerge the overall winner of this competition. Bear in mind, 10 million naira is at stake, a life-changing experience indeed. This is without a doubt the biggest talent horn show in the country. We've seen the magicians grace the stage, poets, instrumentalists, dancers, actors, even actors performed. But all of that will put in perspective at the finale where a winner will emerge. I am VJ Adams. This is the semi-finals. Welcome to the Jasper Talent Horn Season 3. Welcome back to the show. This is the Night Jasper Italian Horn Season 3 semi-finals. A lot is at stake for the contestants and they can't get ready to, you know, get on stage, perform. But remember, after the first set of performances, evictions will happen. And then you'll meet your top eight that will be going straight to the finale. Without further ado, let's bring out your judges. First up... Today, he's dressed like he means serious business. I need you to show some love and make some noise for Dr. Sid. Check out the man in black. Wearing a black suit today. Come on now. Yes. And this is not even the finale. Dr. Sid, take a seat. Take a seat. Turn on your microphone quickly. What, what informed your outfit today? Because I see that all three seasons, this is the first time you're wearing a suit. <laughs> um, simple. Not because I have no feet. But you just want to show I, us today. I don't want to. Um, I love it. Make it not be like, say, I know Sabi or I know Gens. <laughs> Make some noise for Dr. Sid, everybody. All, all right. right. We'll get straight to the performances after the break. Don't move.
I think that was absolutely brilliant. What a way to start the show. I think you guys' vocal synergy was off the charts. I absolutely loved it. Thank I you. don't know how you are coping on that stage because you get confused between which month to look at, which month to follow. Hope you will make your decision backstage. And maybe you can actually give Jay his kiss because, you know, be like, say, what about the child rich, you know, jam. But absolutely amazing. Thank you guys so much for opening this show with such an amazing performance. Well Thank done. You. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. This is the Nigeria Storytelling Haunt Season 3. As you can see, Dr. Sid is here, all suited out. <laughs> but to proceed with the show, it's time to bring out the rest of your judges. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for Ike Obona. Yes. Yes. Next judge coming out. Please give it up for reality TV star Lika Rose. Lika Rose, ladies and gentlemen. And the last but not the least. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Beyonce. Iniedo! Yes. Pink looks amazing on you. Ladies and gentlemen, do you have your judges? IK, how excited are you? It's semifinals, season three. You've obviously experienced two semifinals before. The expectations, the anticipations, how do you feel? Well, it's a period I dread the most because, um, you know, we get to see some of our favorites leave. But at the same time, it just shows that the competition is getting tougher and, um, you know, we have to get to the finals and get a winner. But all the same, uh, it's, it's a good feeling knowing that everyone that's on the stage at this moment deserves to be at the sport. That's right. Very important. Any at all. Um, it's semifinals. I mean, you know how much this means to the contestants. But from a judging perspective, your jobs are about to get very, very difficult. Because beyond the votes on the DTH app, your score sheets play an integral part of who stays and who leaves the competition. How do you feel? Well, the, the tension is definitely very high. I'm very agitated for some of them, as much as I'm anticipating for some of them. Um, it feels great just seeing the whole growth process and the fact that each and every one of them that has made it this far actually has made this whole show a very, a very big one. And I'm very proud of each and every one of them. Absolutely. Uh, Liko, I mean, dance have been very, very incredible all three seasons, but... Uh, for a third season, do you see a dance group perhaps in your top five? Yeah, the way the competition is going, I think I see two dance, top five. I hope so. Hope so, fingers crossed. Very tight. Fingers crossed, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the show continues after the break. Don't move, more performances will take the stage, and then evictions will happen after the first set of performances. Never know how much I love you Never know how much I care When you put your arms around me I get a fever that's so hard to bear You give me fever When you kiss me Fever when you hold me tight Fever ooh, In the morning Fever all through the night 
sun lights up the daytime, moon lights up the night. I light up when you call my name, and I know you're gonna treat me right, chicken. Fever, when you kiss me, fever when you hold me tight. In the morning, fever all through the night. Everybody's got the fever. That is something we all know. Fever isn't such a new thing. Fever started long wow, ago. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay? Oh, Neri Vlog, so you don't dare fall in love. You are still shouting fever. If fever is catch you, you know, see doctor, see your go cure your fever. You that have studied doctor for one year in school, you did not know you don't native doctor. Oh, God of Nazareth. When does this one part for a part of the plan? Ah, that fever will kill you. You will die. Hypertension, tenophresis, all of them will kill you in that fever. You. <laughs> Allow me to. <laughs> if you need money answered all this, I will collect it, but then again. <laughs> oh, God of Nazareth, after being an understanding wife for five years, now all the suit then give me, you give a girl rose flower. Oh, Jesus, my blood is not flowing again. Water is life, because I need it right now. Let me Oh, 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 you don't catch me. How do you know that I like this thing now? Magician, my coming out. Baby boy. Oh. It gives me fever. <laughs> what do you want to do to me? <laughs> hey! Cut! Camera, action! Cut! absolutely loved it, I'm not going to lie. You know, in the fact that you don't talk simply smart, a lot is, um, is left to your expression. You understand? And I think today, for the first time, you took your expression up a level. I absolutely loved it. Um, thank God this show happens after hours, so we know that anybody will get picking for here and your fault. <clears throat> um, I'm going to tell any Amazing choice of song, played well to your strengths, and laughter council. Was that your real bra or just? <laughs> Something came out. Well done, guys. Amotalani, um, how are you? You give me fever today. <laughs> I did enjoy your performance. Uh, it's nice to see you smiling after your performance. Because it's obvious you know when you do well, and you have a smile that follows it, and that little dance. Where is it? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> um, simply smart. I'm beginning to wonder if you really can talk. <laughs> Are you just playing along, or can you not talk? But um, all the same, bro, I do enjoy, I, I did enjoy your performance. Um, for the first time, I could see a smile on your face. You know, it was a little bit weird to see you smiling, because all through this, nine performances, you've not won a smile. I enjoyed the storyline, well executed. And laughter comes with, I mean, you're just a, a bundle of talent, you know, MC, comedian, actress. This was amazing. You guys killed it for me. <laughs> wow, I really enjoyed that. You know, laughter comes with, there's just something about you. I think you're back. Yes, you're back. <laughs> <laughs> you know, your jokes are just incredible when you don't even, you don't stress, you don't, it's like it's spontaneous, you know, you just throw it out there and we're getting it. I'm going to need a song, I love that song, and you sang it very, you know, fever, I love it. And 
I don't know why they keep hearing you and simply smart, you know. I, I don't know. Please don't use magic to take her voice away. She now starts sounding fever. <laughs> simply smart, yeah. I look forward to, to the day you actually say a word. I think that will be one magic that will make me sure. Eh, I didn't wait. No, I don't know. That was amazing. Very, very well executed. I love it. Okay, guys, it was really entertaining. I um, I thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, Simply smart. It seems like we might have to pay money to hear you speak at this point because it's almost like you're doing us okay. Because you know we want to hear you speak. You're never going to speak. You will speak one day. However, you guys, I'm so happy, Motolani. I, I like the vibe that you carry today, the fire today. It reminds me of when we first saw you on this stage. The song choice was amazing. Um, my, my sister over there, you just did your thing. You, you, you have a very spontaneous way of uh, delivering your comedy, like your, your materials are really original. I like it, I enjoyed it. Well done, guys, great job tonight. I put my armor on, show you how strong I am. I put my armor on, and I'll show you that I am. I'm unstoppable. I'm a pusher with no brakes. I'm invincible. To the sound here in my heart, a melody I start, but I can't complete. Oh, I'm screaming out, and my dreams will be heard. They will not be pushed aside and turned into your own. Oh, cause you won't listen. To the sound from deep within, 
this is, I think this is the kind of sound we will hear when we go to heaven. You know, you guys sound like angels. How did they pay three of you like the most powerful voices in the competition ever? Three of you standing right there. The song choice is first of all very ambitious, scarily so. Promise, your voice is literally something. <laughs> ah, bro, it's not fair. They can't give all that talent to one person. That's out of this world. Molly the vibe. Molly the freaking vibe. I'm sorry, pardon my French guys, but Molly the freaking vibe. What? And small, big, small engine, a big, big engine is small. Listen, oh my, oh my God, oh my God. Well done. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Man, no beats needed. Absolutely no beats needed. You guys took these songs and killed them. It felt like you were doing the beats a favor, by the way. Like the beats needed you guys because you guys totally ate it. Amazing, outstanding, man. I can't... I can't run short of words of praises for each of you individually. Molly the Vibes, you know it, man. You're destined for great things. Abe, promise, same goes to you guys. You guys are a blessing to this competition. And I only wish you guys bigger and better things after this competition. Thank you so Bless. Thank you so much. Oh, my God. I don't want to say too much, but I just can't help myself. Um, first off, I don't know who thought about this pairing, but God bless that person. First of all, for this pairing. Secondly, um, ladies first, Abe, God bless you. You're talented. I love the fact that you stood your ground. I think your mic was kind of low, though. But you stood your ground. You killed it. You held that song. Promise, bro. <laughs> that was fire. You came with your A game. I kept you for last because... Last but not the least, no, you're not the least. Trust me, boy. I know you can sing. But I look at you like, yeah, he's good with commercials. I was screaming, I said, he can actually sing. You can sing. Like, you're like a total package in one, Molly. Like, you're like everything in one. You can do commercial, you can actually sing. So if you're on stage performing at your own show, and there's something going on with the, you're like, oh, a cappella, you go right. You guys are match made in heaven. Please, this competition or not, you either win or not, you guys are superstars. Don't ever stop singing. Um, I think you guys should actually go to the studio and record the song you just did today and put it on social media as a cover. I think it does justice to the music. I'm not going to single out any individual, but each of you today gave an amazing performance that is worth any international standard you blew through the roof and i can't wait to see what you guys bring next for the rest of this show well done thank you thank you so much thank you the youth came together as one fighting for freedom freedom from police brutality they said we were lazy because they never believed in the creativity. But no matter what they tried, us boys go rise. And even if they don't believe in us, boys go shine. A country that doesn't believe in its youth is doomed because the youth represent the energy of the nation. The youth are the nation. Certified from beginning, everyone know that we're winning. There's no need competing. We are the best and we did it. Exodus, clouded, 
Set it up, rugged, kill them all, murdered. They can't compete and they know it. Exodus, clad it, set it up, rugged, kill them all, murdered. They can't compete and they know it. Yes, we be killing it. On the dance floor, they know that we're bringing it. They can help it, they hot, yes, they're feeling it. We just set it and do it, believe in it, better believe in it. That's one, right? That's one. What? John. Man, you guys killed this performance. Like I said before, it would be amazing to see Exodus and Clouded Moves as one group. You know, um, Rudasa, I didn't know you could rap. So you write, you're a good poet, and you can rap. All together, this was a very nice performance. You guys put together a performance that showed um, compatibility. I really did enjoy it. Olu, um, no, 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 his name is uh, Olu Dasa. For me, you are the star of tonight's performance. Hands down. This show, this particular performance was yours. Take it. That is not taking away from what all of you amazing superstar dancers had done on the stage tonight. All of you, you dance so well. Like the, the synergy between the two groups is undeniable. The fire, the power that both groups, when you come together, the force that you emit is undeniable. It's just, it's, it's really strong. I don't know if you guys can see beyond you know, wanting to be individual artists or whatever, but whenever you guys come together, it's fire. I really did enjoy, and the variances in your moves today, I was, initially it was feeling like it might be the same moves, but you switched it up, you brought in moves I've never seen you guys do. The backflip thing was like, oh my God, you guys have really evolved. I am just, I'm like a proud mother. Well done, guys. Um, you know, just like Ini said, synergy is amazing between the dance groups. But I think, Oludasa, you did steal the show today. Because it's, it's one thing for dancers to come together and do something, but for a poet to come out of his comfort zone and do, you should say you're a good club, well, well. You know, I really love the fact that you came in and you held your own in the middle of all that choreography going on around you, even when you went to the back and you held the flag, you still stood out. For me, you gave meaning and cohesion to the entire performance, you know, and it was beautiful to watch. Annabelle, Clyde Moves, you guys, you already know what it is. Exodus, Oludasa, well done. Let's go! I believe everything has been said. Oludasa, thank you. I told you to bring it down today and you did. Oh my God, you can rap. What? Do you want to start rapping? I should consider that. Because those flows and I were just jumping on the beat like, you know, those delivery was amazing. You guys did well, but today, oh, look that stuff. Wow. Oh, oh. Damn, and you look nice. I like your, I love your drip, you know. The, 
<laughs> I love the message. I love the whole acting. Oh my God, Exodus. Why the policeman? Mm -hmm. That was mad. That one that lied and I was shooting. That was very, very well put together. Story was clear. The dance moves, organization, everything. Think about it though. Clouded and Exodus. ZS Cloud, what was the name? No, both of you. S Clouded. Think about it because the synergy, uh, the chemistry and the biology is physicing. Please. <laughs> Don't let the mathematics to co-sign this rule. It has to be a tangible effect of this equation. Don't find X when there's Y. Thank you. Welcome back to the show. This is the Nine Jasper retelling Horn season three semifinals. In true fashion of the show, every week we give out three hundred thousand there which is still like a reward for incredible performances the judges they'll do their bit give the badges you the viewers you go on the dth app you vote for those you think deserve the three hundred thousand naira, and voila we bring them on stage we can run them over the check and to announce the winner for hey, that hey, hey. please bring out the check Very ladies and gentlemen a dance group has won this one again make some noise for clouded moves the dance groups this season are on fire, without a doubt. Cloud and moves, ladies and gentlemen. 300,000 Naira, courtesy the royalty badge. Take a bow, head on out. I said take a bow. After the break, in my hands, I have the results, and things are about to get very intense. Don't move. Welcome back to the show. It's time for evictions. Can we have on stage Amutolani, Promise F. Young, Laughter Council, Dark Chocolate, Sharon Eromosele, Exodus Dance Crew, Simply Smart, and Jay Davis. They have performed like their lives truly depend on it. The journey to 10 million Naira will continue for some. And for others, the journey will end right now. The votes are in. Let's get to the result. Can I have Sharon Aramosela step forward? Can I have Amutolani step forward? Good luck to both of you. It's been incredible nine weeks of performances from auditions. You've done exceptionally well. Please put your hands together for them. They've done really, really well. But unfortunately, only one of you will proceed to the finale. After the votes were collated, the next contestant Leaving the competition is. I'm sorry, Sharon, the journey ends here. Amutolani, you're safe. Thank you so much for sharing your talent with us. Things get very emotional at this stage of the competition, as expected. Can I have Simply Smart step forward? Laughter Kansu step forward. The only magician and comedian left in the competition. 
only one of them will proceed to the finale. The next contestant leaving the competition is I'm sorry, Laughter Concert, the journey ends here. <laughs> Simply smart, you're safe. Can I have Exodus Dance Crew step forward? Can I have Promise? Step forward. The next contestant leaving the competition is after the break, stand by. Welcome back to the show. This is the Nine Jazz Perry Talent Hunt Season 3 semifinals on stage. Right now, we have the Exodus Dance Crew and Promise F. Young. The next contestant leaving the competition is. You're safe. Exodus Dance Crew. Exodus Dance Crew. You're also safe. Can we have Jay Davis and Dak Chuckley step forward? The next contestant leaving the competition is Unfortunately, both of you are evicted from the competition. Thank you so much for showing your talents. It's been amazing. After the break, your top eight will take the stage. Don't move. What's up, my people? It's the one and only Talking Drum. He choke, I be no choke. Guys, I'm live at the DTH Season 3 semi-finals here in Nigeria. And guess what? It's been an amazing, wonderful experience with the contestants so far. And I'm here tonight to give you an amazing show. Don't go nowhere, because today, you must choke. Uh, DJ Killer, if you know that you're excited to be here, make some noise. <laughs> wow. Ladies and gentlemen, please celebrate our beautiful judges. Celebrate them now. Ah! Boss Ike, good evening, sir. I celebrate you. Ah, Mama Ini, you find like today bread. <laughs> ah, liquor rose. Ah. <laughs> you know, say, get the way you go find eh? your shadow, get the envy you. <laughs> Based on say, you know, get color. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight, if you are excited, just give your neighbor a high side. Say, my neighbor, whatever you are passing through. Pass through it. <laughs> now your turn. Um, uh, I'm here to have fun tonight. This country don't see nibu. But I keep saying it, and I say it everywhere I go, that whether Tinibu likes it or not, God will use him. 
Is either God use him to do what Peter will be supposed to do, or God use him to continue the lesson Buhari was teaching us? Either way, God go use him. You know what? Where they sweet me now? After the election, both people are voting anymore, and people are not voting anymore. All of us they suffer. Yes. Recently, one Yoruba woman in my area now, she know they use pepper cook stew again. We asked her, Madam, why? She said, which pepper way they find waiting Tinibu Nova show you for this country? Omo, I, I, will always, I will always say this, and I will say it. Nigerian women are the most beautiful women in Africa. Make some noise if you are a beautiful woman. Eh... <laughs> uh, and I know say this particular talk no go end well. <laughs> I don't do anything without talking about my mother because she is a practical example of what an African woman is supposed to be. Stubborn and beautiful. My mother now the only woman with mosquito bites. She catch the mosquito bite and back. Say an eye for an eye. Recently, then give my mother a quit notice for church. Say, may she not they come again. We asked Pastor, what did my mother do? Pastor said, my mother beat the woman with the share bread during Holy Communion. <laughs> Why you beat her? She said, the woman, they look face, they share the bread. Omo, um, you know, I said this. Recently, my mother joined social media. True life story, listen. True life story. My mother joined social media. She not they chat with anybody. The only thing she they do, she they reply the comments of people who comment under my post. <laughs> True life story, not be joke. If you comment something like, wow, this guy is funny, she go reply you, mm, God will bless you. Everything about you will be funny. <laughs> if you can't comment something like, this joke is dry, she will say, that is how you will be dry. Your pockets will be dry. Now me come the back, my mother say, Mommy, not they reply people. She said, okay, if I know make she they reply people, what is she gonna do? I decided to distract my mother with WhatsApp. Big mistake. You know, say any definition you give women, not then they carry. I hope you know. My mother joined WhatsApp. Her sister birthday passed, she not know. Her sister come they provoke for her, say she post and for status. My mother can't call me and say, waiting the status. I tell my mother, say, anything you post for your status, say, anybody where you want make it see him, go see him. Two days later, my mother enter kitchen, snap all the pots where they are our kitchen. Enter bedroom, snap the sheet, come upload for status. Say, no, so any day you come back from school, you go wash all these things. I go call my mother and say, Mommy, not be so then they use WhatsApp. Say, you don't embarrass me now for status. My sister can't make the issue worse. My sister can't send her L O L. She don't know the meaning. She can't chat me up, say, Waiting be L O L. I tell her, say, L O L means laugh out loud. My mother say, Okay. Two days later, she sent me a message. K W P P D K T L L Y. I can't say, Bill, I say, my mother don't get stroke. I rushed back house, asked my mother, I said, Mommy, what did happen? She said, You don't understand the message. I said, Okay, just explain to me. She said, I try to explain to you now. I said, You never still wash that pot where I snapped yesterday. Recently, my mother advised me, she said, no, so you have to be a part of the church. Join a unit in the church. I said, mommy, I know the to-do service. She said, join the ushering unit. Ladies and gentlemen, when I joined the ushering unit in my church, now I can realize that some people now get church. As an usher, you are expected to dress well, smile, and welcome people. Am I correct? Early morning, I wear suits. Enter church. First person they come, I greeted. Good morning, sister. Please sit here. He said, Who are you to tell me where to sit in this church? Don't you know that that charging point over there is my own? 
I said, sorry. The next person that was coming was an elderly man. I greeted, good morning, sir. Sir, please sit here. He said, Mbaga County now. Where were you when we roofed this church? Where were you when we bought this land? Where were you when we built this church complete and bought the sound system? You want to tell me where to sit? I went back to my pastor and said, Daddy, I can't continue this. Please, let me join another department. My pastor said, no. You know, say, pastors have been motivates people. He said, do anything to make it work. I said, okay. The next Sunday, I went to Dube. I brought my cousin brother. He's a deaf and dumb. I kept him at the gates of the church. I told him, Adi bebe. Di bebe. 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 He responded, bebe. The first person was coming and said, Di bebe. Be. The guy said, don't you know? He said, be. Adi bebe. Be. Bebe. Be. Fear, catch the girl. She sit down. And you know, said the fandom, then the quick verse. The guy still go back, go one arm. The next person that was coming was that elderly man. I've already told him, so he said, Dibe. As the man is, I said, Bebe. Be. The man said, Don't you know that we are the only one? Oh boy, judges, don't you feel like he should have come for this season, eh? Don't you feel like Sid, he should have been a contestant for this season, not no, last season? No, 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 no. You know why? Why? It would be an unfair advantage. This man is too good to be on this show. Again, again. Ah, no, 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 no. You have graduated. It's okay, it's okay. The next one is where we are coming for your live show. It's all yes. right, it's all right. By the way, ladies and gentlemen, talking drum, uh, you, you're going to make us a promise. You look out for laughter council. Yeah, most definitely. She has everything it takes to do well in the <laughs> comedy industry. Everything it takes. Ladies and gentlemen, talking drum one more time. Show him some love. Please make some noise for Abe. If I should stay, I would only be in your way. So I'll go, but I know. I'll think of you every step of the way, way oh. and I will always love you. Remember those walls I built Oh baby, they're tumbling down They didn't even put up a fight They didn't even make a sound I swore I'd never fall again But this don't even feel like falling Gravity can't forget To pull me back to the ground again
Okay. I'm not going to lie for me. That's actually one of your worst performances. Your voice is strong. It's amazing. I just didn't understand the composition or the way you put it together. It just didn't come out as expected. And this is the worst day to do that. So, I'm not going to speak too much. I'm just going to say I didn't really enjoy it. I didn't feel it. This performance was 100% beneath you. You are way better than this. Thank you. Um, Abe? Personally, I enjoyed the performance. Thank you. I, I think, I, I know you have an amazing voice. And you will not do wrong on that stage. But I kind of agree with Dr. Seed because even if it's a good performance, it's not good enough for this stage of the competition. And you've done better songs. You get me? Yes, sir. So at this stage should be when you're bringing out your, your ace cards, your joker cards. You know, I do believe in you and I know that you are one of the, 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 the contenders in this competition for the star prize. But come correct next time. All right, thank you. <clears throat> Abe, you've had a very good run in this competition. You look beautiful, by the way. Uh, you are one of the strongest voices in this competition this season. No doubt about that. Not one of your strongest days. I just, I am, I've, I can feel like you, something went wrong. I don't know what it was, but whatever it is, I just want to encourage you to say that you've come this far. I pray that the votes uh, and um, what you've done tonight is able to take you into the next round because I would hate to see you leave soon because you are such a breath of fresh air. You're such a refreshing talent. And I'm just going to encourage you to say whatever it is, hold your head high. You've had a great run in this competition. We'll leave to fight another day. Thank you. Great job. I don't know what it is, but like Ini said, just hang in there. I was looking forward to that. I feel hurt, honestly. I was looking forward to that. And I don't know what it is, you know. You're like, <laughs> I don't know what to say, actually. I was really, really looking forward to that performance. I thought you were going to finish the first song because you're strong enough to kill that song. You can do it. I don't know what the doubt is or maybe you, you lost your voice, maybe you have call for something, but don't feel down too much. I just hope the votes are in your favor and whatever happens, but just know that you are good and just fix it. And you can fix it, trust me, you can. Thank you. Please make some noise for Exodus Dance Crew.
<laughs> Revelation 1 18. Satan has no power to kill you, he can only trick you to die. He has no power to kill you. Jesus, Jesus, <laughs> blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus. I salute you guys. Uh, when you first started, I was a bit concerned because I, I took my time to watch a few of your clips and I saw a little bit of repetition going on and I saw it happen when you guys started performing. But good thing that you guys picked up and you know, made me forget about it instantly and took it to a different level. You guys dancing to Christian songs and bringing in different dance steps into different, I mean, for me, this was amazing. I think, to be honest, um, it, is, it is beautiful to see the level of consistency you guys have brought from day one on this show. Um, today, I saw a different level of storytelling which was amazing to watch and exciting to see, and also inspirational at the same time. I'm sure someone here in this audience needs to know that, you know, whatever it is, God got you. You know what it is. And I think that was a beautiful performance. Well done. I'm super excited for you guys. And I can't wait to see what you do in the finals. I really enjoyed it. It was everything, you know, the old concept, the idea. It was well executed. I wasn't expecting anything less. And thank you for not falling my hand. <laughs> Go and remain blessed. <clears throat> okay, so it was simply electrifying. I was just saying to Ike, I said, I'm personally impressed because you guys have done two very powerful, diverse dance routines, rehearsals in one week. You performed the one you had with the other group earlier on, and then you did this, and still strived and managed to attain some level of perfection. There may have been a few um, clumsiness here and there, but it's the energy that you guys bring, the fire, the hunger, for this. That's what I see amongst three of you. You really want this. And that's what I like to say to young creatives. Just want it enough to work extremely hard for it. If you want it so much, you will definitely get it. So I'm just saying to you guys today that that which you guys are really aspiring for, I pray that God hands it over to you guys tonight. You did an amazing job. I see the consistency in your, in your energy. Well done. Keep on the fire. That's the one key to success. If you keep at it, you will break even at every given point in time. Good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, please show some love for Abu Tolani. Maybe I'm foolish, maybe I'm lying Thinking I can see through this See what's behind and nothing to prove it So maybe I'm lying 
I'm only human after all. I'm only human after all. Don't put your blame on me. Don't put your blame on me. Take a look in the mirror. What do you see? Do you see it clearer? Are you deceived in what you believe? Cause I'm only human after all. I'm only human after all. Don't put your blame on me. Lord, help us above. I'm only human. I'm only human. Don't put your blame on me. Don't put your blame on me. I'm only human, I make mistakes. I'm only human, it's all it takes to put your blame on me. Oh, Matolani. <laughs> You know, your, your gift is very special, it's different. So you would always stand out everywhere you go when you're performing. Um, I, I think that when you went high, it, was, it sounded a bit, a bit um, noisy. I think your high notes were uh, more of screaming. I don't know, it, it didn't quite come together. But other than that, I love I love it when you started with the slow tune and you know it's just I just had a little bit of um, some kind of chaotic whatever when you went very high but other than that when you were do doing your very slow pace whatever it was beautiful I'm just going to wish you good luck and really wish that this show brings you something beautiful I really like your demeanor today. Uh, I like to see you looking happy. You, you are an amazing person, an amazing talent, an, an amazing creative. And I really would like to see you go places. So all I have to say today is good luck. <laughs> all the best. God bless. Thank you. I'm telling me. <laughs> wow. Actually, you sang. Day. like you really came out of your you know the normal and you actually like I'm thrilled like you know and I don't know why you were hiding this or keeping it for later you know you your talent is unique and amazing it's one of a kind you know and I enjoyed that and I just hope that you don't stop and I admire the fact that you're still um, pushing for your talent and actually believing in yourself and I'm amazed, I'm amazed. That was beautiful. It's semi-finals, so I'm going to be very blunt, no sentiment. While I am happy at the fact that you opened your vocal cords today and I could actually hear you sing, I don't know if this performance is something that I feel is final worthy. We've seen a lot of amazing, talented performers on this show blow the roof off this place. And your performance today did not do that for me. So um, that's just where I'll leave it. I think you're talented. You know this. Um, but today, this performance, I don't know. I don't think it blew my mind for uh, to be excited about seeing you in the finals. Thank you. Omutalani. How are you? First of all, congratulations for getting it this far in the for making it this far in this competition. 
I will say one thing though. I I believe that you are very unique as a talent. You do have something to offer the industry that is very unique. But at the same time, I feel that you might need a little bit of more guidance and coaching to reach your peak, to get to that point where you deserve to be. You know, this performance for me was okay. It wasn't amazing, but it was okay. And I feel that you should understand that we are in a stage of the competition where you should be bringing everything in your pocket out. You know, you should come here and be prepared to break, to, to break this place apart. You know, I do hope you make it through. And if you do make it through to the finals, Omotolani, I would really want to see the best of you. Let's. Performing next is... Promise F Young. For so long, for a miracle to come, everyone told me to be strong, hold on, and don't shed the tears. Hush, and now I see the light in the sky oh it's almost blinding me i can't believe i've been touched by me to love let the rain come down and wash away my fears let it feel my soul and drown my fear. Let it shatter the wall for you, oh son. A new day has. Because you said I am love when I can feel a thing, yeah. You said I am strong. When I think I am weak, you said I am hell. When I keep falling short, when I don't belong, oh, you said I am yours. And I believe, oh, I believe what you said of me. Oh, I believe. <laughs> Promise F. Young. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Promise, if there's one thing I do admire about you the most is your humility. You are a very humble guy with a powerful voice. Thank you, sir. And that is one, one gift that will take you very far. Yes, sir. Um, when you started this song, I, I, I honestly didn't think you would, you would pull it off. You know, but I think that you absolutely did justice to the song. Thank you, sir. At some points, I was a bit worried that you wouldn't hit some notes. Yes, but I think you did an amazing job to this song. Thank you, sir. Bless. Thank you, sir. For me, not your best. I think you are amazing. And you stay in your comfort zone. You deliver vocally every single time. Today is semi-final day. There is a certain level of
comfort that people who have had a lot of success or accolades throughout the show always get to when they get to this stage in the show. We've always said something in the beginning. Ike has said it over and over again. Every performance has to be a final performance. You've done better performances than this today. So you understand what I'm saying when I say it's not your best. Yes. Yes. So you go hard and you understand there's one more show, one more performance. Yes. There is no excuses. There's no, this crowd is going to go crazy for me if I cough. You understand? Yes, sir. Because as much as they are here to support you, they can also make you overconfident. So go hard. Make it hard next week. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, I think everything has been said. I just want to chip this in. I think I've always said it. I feel like you're in your most comfortable zone. I'm going to start with, you know you're an amazing singer. We can't take that away from you. You were good. Although, I would like to see you do other genres of music. There are different genres of music. I told you some time ago. Yeah. Because if everyone is in, on their, anyone, every contestant on this show is on their comfort zone, they're focused there, right? Yeah. And they kill it every time. It will favor you. Yes. Do you know that? Yes. Exactly. So... You are on a talent show. Be vulnerable a bit. It's music. You love music. Do you understand? Yeah. For the love of music, just try and bring something different. Okay. Promise you can do it. You're an amazing singer. But please, I would like to see you do a different genre from gospel music. That's all I have to say. Thank you so much. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for Simply Smart. The word is we are disappointed. I'm sorry. I'm going to say that again. I am disappointed. Let me tell you why. I need my Simply Smart back on that stage. I don't know who this guy is right now. See me. I'm here. I see you. You can watch. There's a lot on the table. It says, think of a number between 1 and 63. There will be six cards shown to you. In each one, you have to answer if your number you thought is there. Or not. So, Nikuro Bruce, think of a number between 1 and 63 now and don't say it out. As my assistant brings his six cards to your table, look carefully at the first card and see if the number you thought of is there or not. You have to answer yes or no.
No. I can't hear you. Spell out the word yes. slowly. Please, the third card. We can't hear you. No. Then the fourth. Yes. The fifth. Yes. And the sixth. Look. Yes. I'm not supposed to say my own five letter word or whatever. Nah, any. Think of a word. Any word. Not more than six letters. And please say it out. You can't hide from me. I want your soul. Okay, um, J E S U S. Good. And if you take a look at the stage carefully, you see a red box placed on the stage. Okay. Now my assistant is going to take that red box and what you seek is there. No, it's not. Oh. Well, not be juju be that. <laughs> I'm still terrified. That was the last thing I expected to turn around and see. Like, I feel like I'm going to have a nightmare. <laughs> okay, so we did ask for this, the mystery. The, the, the you know, the... Um, we did ask for something different, something a bit uh, out of the ordinary, and I think that you managed to pull that today. Uh, I, I'm a fan of what you do, if I should say so myself. You, you are you're, you're a fine work of art. You just need a little bit more brushing up here and there. I have no doubt in my heart that you're going to go on to do great magic and do great shows, because you do have the showmanship. You just need to constantly keep working on it. Um, you got me tonight, especially with the creepy show up right behind me with that masquerade. It, it really scared me. I think I'm going to have a nightmare tonight. Well done. <laughs> so I'm back to calling you Simply Wizard. You've earned it back. Uh, your performance today was filled with suspense. That was it for me. 
how you manage to do the table movements and the book movements and still perform a show before we know they hear your voice now we know they see you <laughs> you just come you just appear at the end of the show i hope on the final day you will not just disappear and we have an empty stage with things happening but it's glad to have you back you can see the, the reason why we were upset with your last two performances because we know what we expect from you we know what you can bring to this stage and I am glad that you've brought it back. It's a semi -final. This is a, a worthy semi-final performance, and I do hope that we see you in the final with something more amazing. Bless. Okay, so suspense, showmanship, all of that. But I still think that you needed to work on the pacing. Sometimes the wait periods were a bit too long. It started to get a little bit boring. But I think your trick at the end of the day paid off. So it was entertaining. But in between, there, were in, there was enough time for you to lose the audience. The pacing of your act has to keep the audience engaged for every single second. And I felt you had a few moments there where you could have lost me. But overall, good performance. <laughs> Wait, oh. first of all, I said I want my sleeping smart back. I know say me you can't give me BP. Secondly, like that was creepy. That Max first of all is very creepy. Your eyes actually look scary naturally. So you wearing that Max, it's creepy. I'm glad that the blood of Jesus is on me. I didn't even notice when that thing happened. If not, I would not fly. Miss that side. Yo, that was mad and good. I love it, but please, not me next time. Pick someone else. The table movement and everything, that was a good intro. Yeah, fresh one. Next week is final, so now we know you are back. Next week, disappear. So when we ask you, where are you? Say, I am everywhere. You understand? All right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Oludasa. After this rendition, there are two things likely to happen to me. It's either the DSS puts me in detention or Nigeria pays attention to me. But either way, I blow this kiss to my mother because it might be the last one. I blow this kiss to you audience because it might be the last one. I blow this kiss to you judges because it might be the last one. Because history shows they always cut short the voice of the chosen one. Hello, Auntie Ini. I know you always want me to perform with medulation, but that day is not today. Because every word about to erupt from my guts is a bullet and I'm about to spray. Because we now live in a country where everything is upside down. Cost of living won't kill the living, but we see they catch crews like clowns. What have we done to ourselves? Yeah? We have gotten so carried away by our Afro beats, we are now Afro deaf. Deaf to the cries of the common man. Come on, man. Isn't it funny how our Naira is still falling against the dollar because we are still being ruled by dollars? Central Bank of Thieves. Emir Fiele had us paying 1,005 POS charge for 5K. Nigerians and greed. What have we done to ourselves? Even if we had voted with bleaching creams, I neck elections still wouldn't be free and fair. And the judiciary is just a side chick that the government lays with in bed. So when they say justice is blind, Tell them if you need your eyes to have sex. Because I don't care if you're an AP cow or a PD pig. I don't care if politically you feed on pork or you feed on beef. Because this is the Mount Everest of poetry. And if you didn't get the message, it means you lack the altitude to climb with me.
drops mic and drops dead. Oludasa, you drop mic, you drop dead. I just want to say, the way you set up that poem was absolutely brilliant. You know you're about to say some controversial stuff, but you're ready to take whatever comes. I think the message is powerful. I think your showmanship has improved over this show and is beautiful to see. Thank you very much, sir. I'm happy you're here at this point, still representing such a powerful medium of communication. Thank you very much, sir. Um, that being said, your performance is very strong today. Thank you very much. Worthy of you being at this point of the competition. Thank you. And I'm very, very proud of you. Well done. Ma. So far, tonight, you are the star of this competition. Thank you very much. As far as today's performances go, you are my star tonight. Thank you. Hello. You have shown consistency, consistent growth. Thank you. you hunger for this thing and you're striving for it. And your power of composition is, is immense, it's very powerful. Mm -hmm. The power of your message, the choice of message, and you, you, are, you, you, you prepare. You show me that you put in a lot of work, a lot of creativity, a lot of thoughts you, into your rendition and into your performance. And for that reason alone, you really deserve to be here. Listen, let me tell you, it might not look like you would likely be the winner. I mean, likely, in quote and unquote. Yeah, but if yeah. you keep up, in fact, that's, it's even too late to say if you keep up. You have kept up. And let me tell you what this performance has done for you tonight. It has qualified you to actually win this show. So you stand a very strong chance. Hold your head high. And go back to work. And make sure when you come back next week, Give them a tough competition. You've done amazing tonight. Well done. And you look so good. Great job. You are, this particular poem is a definition of believe. I believed every single word you said. Thank you very much. And yes, we've been saying delivery, delivery, modulation. But this was the perfect delivery for this particular poem. Thank you very much. You couldn't have done it any other way. Thank you very much. Your modulation was on point. Thank you. So even everything that we've said in the course of the show was implemented in this poem. Thank you very much. It's uh, like any rightfully said, this is one of your most powerful performance on this show. Thank you very much. And with this kind of performance, you can stand on any stage with anyone. Thank you very much. You spoke much. like a spoken word Thank you very poet much. today. Thank you very much. Bless. Honestly, I'm so proud of myself for giving the royalty <laughs> bad last week. Nah. <laughs> <Thank you very laughs> because I know me and you had like a rough one, but yeah. the roughness actually worked. It paid, you know? And I just want to say, hmm, that performance is everything and more. Thank you. you actually delivered. Thank you. I don't know what you're bringing next week. I hope and I pray I see you next week. Please give them a hard one. Thank you. you drop the mic, you drop dead. Next week, drop the mic, drop, drop dead. Come back to life. <laughs> no, you can't take the concede. They say you take him with you. <laughs> <laughs> and come back to life. Thank that you. is what a poet is supposed to do. You actually deliver a strong message in the most beautiful and perfect way ever. You know, and your message was clear. I like the fact that you never the fear, you know, you just they touch, they call names, they do all those things. Now you talk on. <laughs> nice one, you're bold. I love that about you. Thank you. I hope I see you next week. And don't forget, bring it on. Thank you. Thank you very much. They say justice is blind, but tell me, do you need the eyes to access? Ladies and gentlemen, Please make some noise for Molly the Vibe.
You know what's so funny? You finished performing and I was still waiting for more. Like, I forgot to clap because I was just mesmerized by your vocals. Molly, it is no secret on this show that I am probably your biggest fan. No secrets. I, I don't even want to hide it. Thank you. Because when you see somebody that is talented, you can't help but show it. I have seen a lot of musicians in my time. A lot of people perform on stage. And I have to say, you are absolutely brilliant. You are a breath of fresh air. I can't even remember if you've ever had a bad day on this show. And for me, it is about you staying humble, understanding the things that have brought you to this particular point, and you keep doing them. I believe there are big things that are going to happen to you after this show. I don't know what they are, but I'm very confident that you are going to take this platform and showcase what the Niger spirit is all about. Well done. Thank you very much. Um, I don't totally agree with Dr. Seed on one thing. I am your biggest fan. <laughs> I can tell you for sure. Maybe he used to be your biggest fan. But you see me, eh? I am your biggest fan. Thank you. My brother, you can sing. I I'm telling you, you can sing. And I don't think the industry is ready for what you're about to bring into it. I wish you everything good that will come out from your talent. God bless. Thank you very much. Let me speak into your future. Let me introduce to you the breakout star of the season. Molly, the freaking vibe. You might see, everybody now is your biggest fan. Had it all before. Mm. Bro, you remember how we started this? You remember? You standing right there, you are a total package of, in fact, I think we've said that way too many times. So let me talk about tonight. You're one artist that came out tonight, performed, you did amazing in the group thing, and you still came out. We were wondering, like, what's going on? Is it that everybody took, put too much energy into the collaborations? But you, you, prov you proved to us that even if you're being, even if they wake you up in the middle of the night, 
nothing comes between you and your vocal ranges. You have it, you breathe it, you live it, you, you, that's what we feel when you get on that stage. Your voice is so extraordinary. Anyway, okay, too much. Thank you, my superstar. I love you so much. I'm so grateful for what you've done tonight. I'm so proud of you. I can't wait to see you when you're like, he, I knew him, he was a DTH, he nice a superstar, yes! Thank you, thank you very much. Molly, I must say that I don't think you've ever had a bad performance. Yes. You know, like I told you earlier, I'm like, oh, you can sing. Not like I didn't know you can sing before, but I didn't know you were that extremely good. And like Ine said, you are a superstar. You are a, <laughs> you're going to be one of the breakout stars from this show. Nothing can change that fact. Just keep delivering. You are just taking yourself up, 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 up there. Please just remain there. And your growth throughout this show has been so incredibly amazing. You know, yeah, everybody saying, oh, yeah, your biggest fan. Well, I know they did your audition, Shia, but your biggest fan, you know your biggest fan. Yeah, yeah, we're not going to pitch for that, you know. I just want to say, please, I want you to bring Cutlass to that um, spoon fight next week. You understand what I mean? Yes. Sir. Bring Shaka Bla. Shaka Bla. Bring Shaka Bla. I'm a tank. To that spoon fight next week. Bring it on. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for Clouded Moves. Initiating robot activation protocol. Full system online. Transform! Commencing second phase of the test sequence. Hey, hey, bitch. New GT in the back, I got them curtains. Don't go pretending this ain't living, don't be nervous. Up in the sky when you are with me. We can be bad, we can be naughty Get up on top of me, swallow me down That, that right there, that right there, I would, I would borrow the, the, the swear word from Ini, is a freaking show! <laughs> Look, when you guys came out with this costume, I said, just watch. They will kill it. And kill it, you did. You guys have been consistent on this show. Your sync is on another level. I think so many times you've been overlooked, but you deserve your flowers. You guys are that good. Well, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> well done, well done, well done. So, when we give criticisms on this show, it's just to spoil you, to inspire you, to challenge you, 
to look within yourself and bring out the hidden talents that we can see, that you perhaps are not seeing, but we can see it because we see from the little things that you do. So we can tell that if you have just a little bit more challenge and more, you know, more drive, there's actually something that you can bring. And I've seen that thing tonight. It's, this, it's a thing I've been wanting to see from the beginning of this show. I've been at loggerheads with, with you guys. Like, there's something. I'm not getting it. I'm not getting it. For the past two, three shows, you guys have consistently brought it. You deserve to be in the finals. It's a beautiful, beautiful performance. The whole theatrics, the stage movement, the synergy, the costume is brilliant. This is international standard. You guys, you... You are amazing. I'm so proud of you. Well done tonight. I'm so proud. Well done. Great job. I was waiting for more. <laughs> I was waiting for more now. That was short, though. I don't know. That was very short for me. I didn't really like it. So I'm going to be honest with you guys. I felt like you guys are kind of like, what the? That was mad. <laughs> you guys killed it. That is what I'm talking about. I hope I see you on next week. Oh. I'm seeing you on next week. Thank you. <laughs> so, I want to advise you the weapons you need to come with. Bring it all. That well of talent that you people have, go and dig it well. Go and dig out the hole. Bring everything out. Yo, it's going to be very tough. Give them. Don't make it easy, you understand? I hope you win. Whatever happens, Whatever, whatever. I'm seeing you next week and bring it on. And <laughs> shout out to that guy, man. Shout out to him. Um, yeah, it, it's all been said. I think you guys are by far the best dance crew that I've seen on this show since season one. And I'm so proud of the fact that you guys are going to be in the finals. In my opinion, though, because... It's about time we see some amazing performances and showmanship. You get, it was beautiful, short, sweet. I wanted more, I'm not gonna lie. You get, but it made me look forward. I'm looking forward to your next performance. And that's what it's about. I had one of you went to the hospital last week after your performance. I'm happy to see that you guys won the royalty and you're back here today giving an amazing performance. Stay hydrated, drink lots of water, yeah. and like she said, bring everything mm. next week. Well done. Okay. No ways be on your Jesus. And get some sleep. I don't want nobody fainting. What a semifinals it's been. Absolutely phenomenal in every sense of the word. But now, let's get to some business. The judges will give out four royalty badges, and you know what that means. It gives the contestants a chance to win 300,000 Naira while they get into the finale for the big prize of 10 million. Ladies and gentlemen, let's bring back your top eight. Molly the Vibe. Clouded Moves. Promise, F. Young. Abbey. Exodus Dance Crew, Amutolani. And Simply Smart. And the man who's had a great semifinals, Uludasa. Judges, um, you know what this means? It means a lot to them and to their stay in this competition. I thought we're done with the deliberation. Here we go. Sid? Um, this, for me, is a no-brainer. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Molly Divide. Here we go. That puts him in a chance to win 300,000 hours. You need to go on the DTH app and vote. This has happened every week since the first week. And this is the final royalty badges for this season. So that means absolutely so much. All right. Lika Rose, who gets your royalty badge? Uh, that's a tough one. <laughs> Clouded moves. 
All right, Claude and Moose. Remember, this will be the last time the judges will give out royalty badges. I mean, it's the semifinals. Easy. What's left is a winner of the show. Iniero, your royalty badge? Uh, for me, it's the star of the night. Oludasa. And Oludasa, the poet, gets a royalty badge. Also, remember, if you think he deserves a 300,000 error, go on a DTH app and vote for him. He needs the vote for that. And that's quite incredible. And the last but not the least, royalty badge for the top eight. Semi-finals, DTH season three, IK, who gets it? So for me, just because uh, as good as every other person's performance was, they underperformed, and the only person that stepped up for me tonight was Simply Smart. All right, Simply Smart. Great. There you go, the final royalty badge for this season. It's a level playing ground for the contestant. The votes would mean a lot, but more importantly, the judges' report sheet would mean a lot in determining who would emerge the overall winner of 10 million Naira at the finale, and that's exactly in a couple of days from now. So go on the DTH app, vote for your favorites. They've been absolutely exceptional from the very first week. Um, the social handles will pop up on the screens as well. I am VJ Adams, and I'll see you at the finale. Good night.